Okay, so I have my scientist animated here, and I'm going to export the SMD and compile the model. So here we have our keypad lean sequence. And I changed it a little bit, you know, made a little fans here. But he punches the keypad, he leans again, he looks, and then he relaxes. So under your source export, you want to export as an SMD. And you want to make sure that this keypad lean SMD is the only one selected. So you're going to click on that guy and hit export. And then just make sure it's anims keypad lean dot SMD. So I'm going to go to my models folder and check out my Half-Life 1 scientist. And you should see that we have, no, anims, I'm sorry. It's in the anims folder. Oh, it puts it in that folder. The keypad lean. Um, but <coughs> because the Blender tools export to source, we have to fix this. So in my studio model folder, I have the source to gold source converter and I'm just going to drag that onto the converter and you see it's uh, zero successes uh oh I don't know but it says all files converted anyway here's keypad lean fixed uh, and you can tell the difference between them if you go in and you scroll down you should see you know what doesn't look to be any different but you always want to fix the outputs. So we're going to copy this keypad lean fixed and put it into the base folder somewhere in here. Here it is. And we're going to grab our scientist QC folder. I already made a backup of it so we don't accidentally overwrite. And I'm going to open it with Notepad. And all the way down the bottom here, we're going to add it all the way down the bottom. So I'm going to copy this Neil sequence and paste it in here. And again, it's called keypad underscore lean fixed. And the same thing over here. I cannot type right now. And we're going to go 24 frames per second because in Blender um, the frame rate is 24 frames per second. And you can see this in the render tab. You can double check that. So that's all good. We can save this. Remember to make a backup before you do that. And now you're just going to grab the QC file and drop it onto the studio model program. You can see it compiled there. And we get a bunch of these models. So I'm going to open this with Half-Life Model Viewer and see we have our scientist that compiled fine. If you go to sequences, all the way down the bottom, you will see our keypad lean. So that works great. We are now ready to put this into a Half-Life map and have this guy punch a bunch of keys, look through what looks to be a window, and make sure everything works great. Thanks for watching. Again, uh, like it, drop me a comment. If you want me to do anything else with Blender and Gold Source, let me know.